let us start this present calendar on this adventure works data set so go to the uh, visuals and you can just type your talent by calendar and you can just use this calendar just click on add here once you click on this add your visual will be imported here so you just click on this and it is asking you only two values like it is asking you for the dates you can see here and the values here so for the dates let me take a date column and let me select the date inside the date field and let me do that with respect to the sales amount so let me take a sales amount in the values now you can see here we got the three years sorry four years data and so if you have taken the date here and the sales amount here you can see like a date wise or a year wise sales and if you get a darker uh, like dark color you can say that you have a more sales for this year so you can drill down and drill up on all this but here uh, you can avail this beautiful visual by just just taking off this date hierarchy so here you get a date hierarchy by default just click on date so once you click on date you can see the change in this visual now you can see beautifully you got all calendar so this looks like our calendar and it's starting from july and you can see the shades here so there are so less sales on these particular dates and you can if you just scroll down or if you just hover your cursor you can see the sales amount also beautiful you can see august 8th or 17th august your sales amount was this much and your september your most sale was in the month of november in the month of december you do not have much sale so you can just scroll down and see on which particular days you have more sales by looking at these you can do some analysis like hey on saturdays and sunday i have more sale on winter i have more sale on any festival season i have more sale by just looking at these visuals i can do the uh, decisions on my data so what formatting you can do on this talent calendar is go to this format visual uh, you can uh, like change this calendar like it is starting from sunday actually this is sunday monday if you want a i want it from monday you can start it from monday now you can see here it will you will get monday here so it will see monday tuesday wednesday and saturday sunday you can see it here and it is asking you for the column so if i just increase uh, one column and two column you can see the change here so it will show in this way so i don't recommend using this column option here okay yeah so this is how your talent calendar works let me reset it and you can see you can change colors also by default it is that green color you, if you want you can change it to blue you can change it to black or something like that and the shades will be automatically so it takes one or two seconds and you can work on that so this is how your talent calendar in the visual works i hope you got this video guys so if you like it please subscribe to my channel and like this video share it with your friends thank you for watching again please subscribe and keep learning